Hey everybody, Thomas from Thomas Pipeworks here. Uh, if you go to my website, www.thomaspipeworks.com, and you go across the top header, you'll see uh, one of the headings is uh, anatomy, bagpipe anatomy. And I usually like to talk about um, the aesthetics of different types of uh, bagpipes. Just to continue that a little further, what I have here is a little bit more bagpipe anatomy for you. And what I'm going to do here is uh, take a, a middle section here. This is a this is a middle section from a from a, a base section. I have another video on um, just the general information on bagpipes. You can always refer to that video if you're not sure of any of the terminology here. This is a middle section, and what I'm going to do here is show you what the inside of a middle section looks like. Now here we have a blackwood piece and this this one's made of uh, plastic. I have a cross section of, a, of this middle joint. So you can see what's happening inside the the midsection here. Now You'll notice a bigger bore here and a smaller diameter bore along here. This smaller diameter bore is called the long bore because it's longer and this section here is called the tuning bore uh, and that is because when you get the part that goes into the middle section, the base bottom section, the base bottom section comes in here and you find out where you're optimal tuning range is to lock your pipes in. Down here this is where your ferrule would go and right here is where your projection mount would go. In comparison. And there you have a little bit of bagpipe anatomy. Go to my website thomaspipeworks.com and see some more anatomy there. See ya.